Is it really NBA playoff basketball if Draymond Green hasn't found himself in the middle of some type of controversy? Well, that's exactly what happened last night in Game 2, Sacramento Kings versus Golden State Warriors. And the Kings did win this game. They're now up 2-0 in the series. The Warriors defending champs in big trouble against the Kings. But that's not really what everyone's talking about. What everyone's talking about is what happened with Draymond Green and DeMontis Sabonis of the Sacramento Kings during the fourth quarter. Warriors Draymond Green ejected for stomping on DeMontis Sabonis' chest during the Kings Game 2 victory. This is not the first time Draymond's been ejected in big playoff games. I don't know if there's going to be a suspension coming from this. In all likelihood, it seems possible given Draymond Green's history, his reputation, and what happened on the floor. But this was the scene. The fourth quarter of this game, Sacramento's up by four, and uh, you can see what happens right here. Uh, we're going to pause it. We're going to play a couple different angles. We're going to talk about it, analyze this a lot. Because after Sabonis goes down, Draymond Green clearly stomps on him. And Curry's got the board. Green gets now it's right there. You just saw that happen. And we'll watch everyone react here in a second. And a technical has been assessed. Uh, let me Sabonis say, is down. Let me say this. Now, obviously, the crowd reacts in a big, big way. Um, but let's just watch this angle here of what exactly happened. I'm going to show the whole thing to you. Now watch the end of this play. Now Sabonis is right here. Clay Thompson's boxing him out. He gets tripped up and falls on the ground, okay? As he goes down, watch him grab. He goes down on the ground, rolls up towards Draymond, and it looks like, to me, it looks like Sabonis kind of brings his hands up to try to cover his head because he is on the ground with a lot of people trying to get a rebound and stomping around. That's kind of what it looks like to me. He does wrap up Draymond's leg when that happens. Grab Draymond right there. Now, that right... <laughs> but then, what Draymond does is a little bit extra. He tries to... He does free himself from Sabonis's grasp right there. Whether that's intentional or not, I kind of think it's reactionary personally, but I don't know. That's just what I see. As he goes out, watch him grab Draymond right there. Now, that right there. And then Draymond stomps on him. Now, I don't think Draymond was trying to put his full weight. I think Draymond realized what he was doing in the moment. I thought, oh, fuck, I just stomped on this guy. I can't put all my weight on him. That's why he kind of leaps up with his other leg. He didn't want to put all of his weight on him. But I think Draymond overreacted in the moment and stomped on the guy. Like, that's what happened. It's really hard to deny that fact. Here, here's more of it. Let's take another look. Different angle. And that's what I mean. I think that Sabonis is trying to cover, like, just protect his head when he goes down. That's what I think is happening. But that, that's, you can't, do, Dray, that's Draymond fucking green, okay? You know all eyes are going to be on him. You know anything he does, people are going to pick apart. You can't fucking do this. He stomped on the guy while he was on the ground. He's going to be ejected for this. That looked purposeful and intentional. That was purposeful. That was intentional. Now, Draymond Green has since tried to defend himself and say, what am I supposed to do? A guy grabs my leg the second time in two nights. He grabbed my leg. He then went on to say he asked for x-rays because he felt like he got hurt by Sabonis, by Sabonis grabbing him. You've had people like Shaquille O'Neal and Damian Lillard. Some NBA players come out and defend Draymond and say, hey, a guy's grabbing your leg. You got to free the leg. It didn't look like it was super intentional. To nearly everyone um, in the sports world, out of the sports world, it looks intentional from Draymond. Was there reasons that he did it? Was his leg wrapped up? Was he trying to free his leg? Certainly. But Clay Thompson tried to say, well, when you're running full speed, someone grabs your leg. What are you supposed to do? He wasn't running. Draymond Green was at a standstill. And again, I, I understand. I understand trying to free your leg uh, from what was happening. And I think Sabonis was probably trying to protect himself. But that was inexcusable from Draymond Green, especially when you know your reputation and when you know the fact that everyone's looking for a reason. Draymond Green just gave him a reason, and he may be suspended, potentially, by the NBA. And if that happens, you're talking about a Warriors team that's trying to avoid going down 3-0 that might be without Draymond. This is bad, bad news, and I just don't think that uh, I, I don't think most people are going to have or be sympathetic towards Draymond in this entire thing when you look at how Grab it all Draymond, went Draymond, right there. Now, that now, Sabonis, to his credit, did after the game say, hey, listen, 
You know, I just fell down trying to protect myself. Don't know what happened. That's part of the game. It's intense. It's play ass. He didn't slam Draymond. He didn't try to add fuel to the fire or anything like that. Yeah, I don't think he wanted to give anybody bulletin board material. But Sabonis should be fine after that. He had x-rays, all that bullshit. But what do you guys think? Uh, again, more Draymond Green chaos. And that's just par for the course when it comes to the NBA playoffs. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Smash a like button. Subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell for notifications. Share this video out there. And I'll talk to you later.